Moss flower lay deep in the grip of midwinter, beneath a sky of leaden grey that showed tinges of scarlet and orange on the horizon. A cold mantle of snow draped the landscape, covering the flatlands to the west. Snow was everywhere, filling ditches, drifting high against hedgerows, making paths invisible, smoothing the contours of earth in its white embrace. The gaunt, leafless ceiling of moss flower wood was penetrated by constant snowfall, which carpeted the sprawling woodland floor, building canopies on evergreen shrubs and bushes. Winter had muted the earth. The muffled stillness was broken only by a traveller's pause. A sturdily built young mouse with quick dark eyes was moving confidently across the snowbound country. Looking back, he could see his tracks disappearing northward into the distance. Further south, the flatlands rolled off endlessly, flanked to the west by the faint shape of distant hills, while to the east stood the long ragged fringe marking the marches of moss flower. His nose twitched at the elusive smell of burning wood and turf from some hearth fire. Cold winds soughed from the treetops, causing walls of snow to dance in icy spirals. The traveller gathered his ragged cloak tighter, adjusted an old rusting sword that was slung across his back, and trudged steadily forward, away from the wilderness, to where other creatures lived. It was a forbidding place, made mean by poverty. Here and there he saw signs of habitation. The dwellings, ravaged and demolished, made pitiful shapes under snowdrifts. Rearing high against the forest, a curious building dominated the ruined settlement, a fortress crumbling, dark and brooding. It was a symbol of fear to the woodland creatures of Mossflower.